Welcome to another episode of White Belt Wednesdays. Uh, in this episode, I'll show you uh, a common mistake I see when people are playing open guard. So one of my students had this uh, occur in a, in a recent competition. Uh, he didn't use his, uh, all of his limbs properly and the guy just ran through his guard and passed. Um, so it's really important when you're playing guard, you're using all of the limbs. So first I'll show you how it went with him and then I'll show um, you how to do it uh, in a better way. Marty was playing uh, color and sleeve guard, color sleeve, and this is one of the hardest guards to play because uh, you really need your feet to play. So it's it's a good one for beginners to learn how to use your feet, but it's also hard. It's a lot easier to just go to like a spider guard where you can just hold on, um, as in a color and sleeve where you have to like constantly off balance your opponent and keep him um, like on the defensive. So uh, the main principle I want to give you guys today is that you always need to use both of your limbs. So. Uh, as you can see in the video, Marty was just here and his feet are just floating in the air. When I'm playing guards like this, always kicking, controlling the arm, constantly moving my opponent around and looking for submissions or sweeps. So you can't just hang around with your feet. All your limbs have to be doing something. So my hands are occupied with the sleeve and the collar, and my feet are kicking the leg, controlling the arm, never just hanging around and always looking for the submission. So. And the video I'll show you now, you see one of the best color and sleeve players at this moment, uh, Tommy Langeker, uh used these principles and he just recovers his guard using both uh, all of his limbs and he immediately attacks, which is really cool to see. Hope you like that again. Uh, it's a small principle, but it's really important. Whenever you're playing open guard, make sure all your limbs are doing something. As soon as you notice one hand is loose or one feet is just in the air, you have to do something with that foot or hand. So either grab something or kick something out of balance your partner. Never have uh, one, uh, a limb doing nothing. Always be uh, working in open guard. Otherwise, it's going to be really hard. Um, hope you like the video. Hope you can apply these concepts immediately. And if you liked it, make sure you uh, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, leave a like, uh, tell me what you want in the next videos, what problems you encounter as a white belt. And if you want your own videos analyzed, just click on uh, this link right here and I'll uh, do a video analysis of your fight. So I'll give you a personal analysis, uh, tell you what you could do better specifically uh, to improve your own game.